Hi everyone, it's Lena over at Sweet Nothings Paper Company and I just wanted to show you a shadow box I just finished of me and my hubby. So this picture here was taken in Las Vegas a couple years ago and this is what I did. So this is the whole frame in its entirety. So I've assembled it. I've actually left out the glass um, even though I had more than enough room I just kind of liked the look of it without the glass on the front so um, you know avoid getting glares and you know when you walk by it's just, it's just more real to me <laughs> so I just left out the glass um, starting off so the paper in the back is from Kane Company um, Amy Butler um, with Amy Butler um, and it's one of I forgot what the pack is called but it's um, uh, it's a it's a pad that's all blue and uh, craft card stock the whole book is that way the whole pad is that way so I just put that in the background because I really like the colors of it and then um, what I did is in the corner here I added um, a lollipop rose that I made and it's in blue and black and cream and coming out of the <clears throat> excuse me of the lollipop rose are some feathers I'm not sure if they're pheasant but they're pretty <laughs> I've got some pearl there and I've also got some black sequins here and then what I did here is I embossed the word love uh, with my Versamark and then black embossing powder um, then heat set that and then did some finicky cutting um, around the word and then laid that on top of another um, piece of um, matching card stock and then cut around that and then I have it just it's kind of hard to tell maybe if I can show you behind have it up on some three-dimensional um, pops so what I did is I just layered three of them so it just it really popped out that's what I did there and then I have if you can tell throughout the length of it they're starting from here and going all the way upwards what I did there is I initially put a thick black band of lace um, going upwards um, vertically on the page and then I added um, a green piece of ribbon satin ribbon on top of that now the green is more like an apple green ribbon and then what I did on top of that is I had some really nice flocked um, cutout. So what I did is just layered that on top of the green. So it just kind of looks like it's one lace piece. And it's super cute and I love the way that worked out. And then I used my Martha Stewart Classic Butterfly Punch. And I punched out these butterflies. So now I've got them just sporadically placed all around with some bling. And I love the way this turned out. I am so in love with it. I'm going to hang it on my wall. And um, I'm very proud of it and I hope that you guys like it too. Please comment. Um, I'd love to hear what you guys think. And that is it. So thanks for watching guys and we'll keep in touch. Talk to you next time.